Listen, we can't have no playoffs in any sports without them sliders, especially the NFL. So today, I'm going to show you guys how to make bacon cheeseburger sliders. Man, you're going to love this one. I'm telling you. You ready? Get in your kitchen. Let's go. All right, so here are the ingredients we're going to use for today's recipe. So let's get started with it. Right here we have our Hawaiian rolls right here. We have some ground beef. We have some diced tomatoes here. Now, guys, if you don't like tomatoes, you can leave your tomatoes out. But what goes good with hamburgers? Tomatoes and some onions here. And, of course, we got our shredded cheese here. Then we have some uh, sliced cheese here. We also have some ketchup, mayo, and some Dijon mustard, some minced garlic, some adobo seasoning. Guys, if you don't have adobo seasoning, use some salt and pepper. We have some olive oil and, of course, that bacon. Whenever you add bacon and cheese to anything, you got you something special. You are 75% there. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, guys, so to get started, we're going to crank up our cooktop, and we're going to heat up a table, half a tablespoon of uh, olive oil. And once that starts to heat, we're going to drop in our ground beef along with our onions. We're gonna start breaking that up with a wooden spoon. Once you get it broken up like that, you wanna come across that with your uh, adobo season or your salt and pepper. Of course, we're gonna cook this all the way through until it's brown and our onions soften. Now you want to add your minced garlic. All right, guys, once there's no more pink, you want to pause your heat and you want to remove your pan and you want to drain out the fat. All right, you want to unpause your heat, reduce it down a little bit. You want to add your diced tomatoes. Make sure they're, they're drained. You want to add your ketchup, mustard, and mayo. Now, guys, if you don't want to use mayo or ketchup, you don't have to do this, but, you know, this is all optional. And we're just going to get this mixed in really quick. All right. Now we're gonna stop our heat, we're gonna remove our pan, and we're gonna bring over our bun so we start building out our sliders. All right, to get started, we're gonna place the bottom half of our buns on a greased baking sheet like I did right here. And we're gonna take our cheese and we're just start, gonna start placing it at the bottom and this is our sliced cheese. Next, we're going to take our ground beef mixture and we're going to spread it evenly over uh, on top of the cheese. Next, you want to take your shredded cheese and you want to add that over the top of your ground beef. You know what? Let me hold that up real quick. Let me not do that first. Let me add my bacon here. It's okay to add a little layer right there. You want that bacon, to, that cheese to melt on top of that bacon. I think that's better than to add the, the cheese first and then the bacon. So I like that little bottom layer I just add like that. That's very, very, hey, I'm smart. Now let's come back over that with that cheese. And guys, you already know what the last step is. We're gonna add our top part of our buns back onto our sliders. Now we're gonna take our butter. I've melted it, and we're just gonna brush the top of our buns just like this with that butter. And the last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna drop some of them sesame seeds on top of it like this to give it that burger look. So now I've already preheated our oven at 350 degrees. We're gonna place it in the oven and we're gonna let this bake for 10 to 15 minutes until that cheese is melted and the tops are golden brown. All right, let's get this baby into the oven.
Yep, it's quality control time. Man, look at that. I got my bacon cheeseburger sliders. Man, these babies, they bite size and they cheesy. And y'all already know, they bacony. Now, is that a word? All right, let's go ahead and try it out. Well, it's a cheeseburger. I take that back. I'm not even disrespect it. It's a bacon cheeseburger. It's different. Mm. Oh, man. This thing is delicious. Oh, boy. Hmm. I got Leah right here looking exactly at me. I got this one right here on my plate. And she looking at me like, I want to try it out too. Come on in here, Leah. Come on. I'm going to pick the Leah up. We love us some cheese, baby, don't we? Mm -hmm. Oh, man. This is not how I typically eat holding my daughter. So we're going to go ahead and get out of here again. All wings, everything. You know who we are. I'm Spinelli. This. Leia. And remember, we're not we're no, no chef. chef. We, we just cook a lot. lot. And we are out. Peace. Peace.